Hi, this is Roger D. Rue. My website is freecomputerconsultant.com. I've got a question for you. Is your computer running just great right now? Fantastic. What are you going to do next time it isn't? Well, I've got a little tip for you today. If things are working just great right now, why not set a restore point? This is something that Windows XP can do to kind of take a snapshot of where you are right now. So that if you maybe try to install a piece of software, things didn't work out too well, doesn't uninstall properly, now your computer isn't running great, you can actually go back to that restore point and get things back up and going the way they were. Now some softwares will actually create a restore point before they do an install or a lot of Windows updates will do that, but not always. So if your computer is running great right now, why not take just a minute and create a restore point? To do that, we're going to go down here to the Start button, go to All Programs, and as you can see, Windows has conveniently uh, buried this option down here in Accessories, System Tools, down here at the bottom is System Restore. And here you get this nice little welcome screen, it gives you two options. You can either restore the computer to an earlier time or create a restore point. And down here you can see System Restore Settings. Now you can see right here the, uh, the settings right now are 10% of the drive. I think that's the default. It's about 5 gigabytes of space. If you have a very large drive, you might want to slide that down just a little bit because you really don't need much more than you know, maybe 5 gigabytes of space for that. that. That's quite a bit. But on a large drive, it, it might show a lot higher and you really don't need that much. But, but you can change that if you need to. And you can also see if perchance a system restore has been turned off and it gives you a chance here to uh, to turn it back on by unchecking that box if that's the case. But right now we're going to do a restore point. We're going to create a restore point. We're going to click next. And here you have a description. And notice that it says the current date and time are automatically added. So you don't have to include that in the description. I'm just going to put computer running great. Click on create. New restore point. It's got today's date, time, and my comment. That's all there's to it. You can close that and hopefully your computer will stay running great. But if it's not, here's a restore point that might help you get back to where you want to be after something went wrong. For other great tips and tricks, I hope you visit my website, freecomputerconsultant.com, and I hope this uh, video tip today has been helpful. Thanks for watching.